name's Dale Black, president of Black Knight Industries, home of Gamma and Frog Hair Fishing. And today, we're going to look at a special trick that we're, we can use in fishing clear water with brush piles, where you want a heavy line, but you want that nice braided feel, lots of torque and pull. With Gamma Torque in the 1680 pound, it's a hollow core braid. It gives us the advantage of being able to actually thread a fluorocarbon leader into the center of your braid. And this is a 16 strand braid. This is a special Daho needle that allows me to put my line inside. Once you do that, you gently insert it into the center of your braid and you just keep threading the braid onto your needle. And you run it about, with the braid I'm using, a 60 pound, I'm using a uh, 40 pound leader. You just keep threading it up and if it pulls out like that, you pull it back and just keep gently pushing it through. So you can put your braid completely on your, uh, your fluorocarbon, which I'm using here, right up gently up inside the center of the braid. Like I said, if it keeps popping out, you just thread the needle back on. You want to make sure that you have it nice and straight because the straighter you have your uh, needle with the braid, the easier it is to get it to thread up through. And I've been doing this for all oh, several months doing these type of, of uh, threadings and it has now become it's fairly second nature. And you run it up about three foot with what I'm using here. The, the smaller the diameter of your insert material, whether it be a, a nylon monofilament or a fluorocarbon, it depends upon how far you put up. The, the narrower it is, the, the uh, actually the smaller the diameter, the larger I'll, farther I'll run it up. Pull it down onto the line. You can actually see there's my leader material. And what I do is, while it's still all pushed and crimped up on here, that's where I'll pull down on my leader material so it'll pull back inside the braid at the very top. And then I will grab the braid because now it's inside. There's my braid, here's my leader material. I'll stretch this down. And you can see that I've got a prop, probably about three feet there. Now this works like the old to the Chinese finger traps. The harder you pull on it, the the harder it actually grips onto that line. To finish this off, you would use a small piece of whether it be floss or another small piece of line, you put a little nail knot at the end. And what that does is that keeps the uh, braid from releasing, because if you go like this and, and push up on it, it will release the braid. So we use a little bit of a, I just put a little nail knot at the end, it doesn't even as wide as what the, the braid actually is when it's done. And now you have a wind on leader or a top shotting from, from the saltwater community, but it gives us a way to use a fluorocarbon leader material that's clear, so when you're fishing those clear brush piles, it gives you that invisibility that you're looking for, but still have the strength and power and feel of braid, and no weak link with the knot. Thanks for watching.